Good evening, everyone. I'm Jamison Euler. And I'm Wendy Ryan. Thank you for joining us at this hour. Most of the results for Florida's primary election are in. We want to bring in our Paul Legrone now to show us what was the result of Florida's gubernatorial primary tonight. Paul? Yeah, pretty clear result here, guys. The Democrats have tapped Charlie Crist to take on Governor Ron DeSantis in November. You see the numbers there, 60% to 35%. Nikki Fried only carried three counties, Alachua County and Gainesville, Bay County, Walton County, but clearly the winner there. Charlie Chris will now face Governor Ron DeSantis in November. Our Eric Waxler kicking off our team coverage. He's been covering the Chris camp. He tells us that Chris supporters are now focused on 10 weeks till the next election night. It didn't take long before Charlie Crisp was able to deliver his victory speech. This race was over around 8 o'clock. Chris thanked Nikki Freed for what he called a hard fought primary, but quickly turned his attention to Governor Ron DeSantis. Chris said he will beat DeSantis in November. The former Republican says he no longer recognizes leaders of that party, saying they are now extremists. Chris says when he was governor before, he represented all Floridians. Make no mistake about it, because this guy wants to be president of the United States of America, and everybody knows it. However, when we defeat him on November 8th, that show is over. Chris says his top issues include dealing with Florida's affordable housing crisis and restoring reproductive rights. Chris also said when he's elected governor, he will immediately reinstate Andrew Warren as Hillsborough County's state attorney. Warren was, of course, suspended by Governor DeSantis. In St. Petersburg, Eric Waxler, ABC Action News.